Jaws 2, The Lego Movie, Part 2. Enjoy. When Buddy returned to the police station. Uh, Mr. Mayor? Ah, Brody, what's up? I haven't seen you for a while now. Oh, wait, let me straighten out my hands. So, what do you need? Mr. Mayor, you're gonna really hate when I say this. Um, okay. Go ahead and say it. I think we might have to close the beaches again. What? Why? Well, I think we may have another shark problem. You can't be serious, right? Well, you bet I'm serious. Oh my gosh, Brody. Come on. In the middle, in the second summer, or in the summer of 1978, this is the year where, like, almost, like, everybody... Oh, I lost my head for a second. Hold on. Sorry, I returned my beautiful hair. But come on, 1978... In the su well, in the summertime, everybody just starts going around the beaches and starts swimming. I don't want to scare my my beachgoers again. No, not again. No. But it's a very serious problem. I found Josh's boat washed up on the beach this morning, and there was a bl there was blood on the back of his boat with even a finger on there. Wait, Josh, Josh the fisherman, Josh like the Josh the actual fisherman. Uh, yeah, why? He was reported all over the news this morning going missing. Well, I still think we should close the beaches. No! We are not closing the beaches, okay? Not closing the beaches, Broti. Get that through your thick skull. What else do you want me to do about this problem? Nothing, because we have no problem, okay? And I'm sure something else could have happened to Josh, okay? I'm pretty sure that, like, some murderer could tuck, may, may have tuck in him. Maybe cut off one of his fingers on that boat right there. Maybe left him in a bloodbath. But I'm sure somebody will find out about something, okay? But we're not closing the beaches, okay? Who knows? Maybe Jack the Ripper could have done it. Jack the Ripper died in, 19, in 1888. Whatever. But Mayor... Ugh. Stupid. I gotta go to the beach and cool off some steam. Excuse me one little second, guys. One second, please. Mr. Brody! Ah! Oh, Scott! Jeez, you scared me! <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to scare you. How are you doing today? Good. I'm doing good. How about you? Oh, me and my walker are just chilling here. Yeah, how are you doing, Mr. Brody? Good. Hey, did you guys happen to notice that Josh has gone missing? Josh the fisherman? Oh yeah, he was all over the news this morning. What do you think could have happened to him? But it could have been like some boating accident or something. A boating accident? Yeah, it has happened around here before. Hmm. Well, the mayor never mentioned a boating accident like a few years ago. When we had like the same problem or something. But I think it could have been a shark. Brody, Brody that's impossible. The sharks don't like our warm water. Well, well, a few years ago, there was a couple shark attacks and I had to go out and kill the shark along with Quint and my friend Cooper. Who's Quint again? He's the famous fisherman. 
Oh, he's the greatest fisherman of all time. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, I know that guy. Wait, what even happened to him? He hasn't been around for a while. Dude, he died. He should have been all over the news. Actually, he was not all over the news because people didn't know about his death. Well, Hooper and I did, and we told it about the police. <laughs> did the police do anything about it? No, he just told him of what happened. So, what are you and Lily about? Called, since you both have one arm. And you're both husband and wife. Um, we're called the one arm family. Yeah, because we both lost our arms into something. Well, we're called the superhero, actually. We're called the superhero, uh, brothers. Because we're both brothers, actually, and we're both made from superhero comics. So, Jake, what happened to your arm, actually? Oh, my arm? Yeah, a bull shark ripped it off. But me and Lily know how to swim with one arm now because we took training lessons about that. Yeah, and I lost my arm to, like, some sort of, like... Ugh. Well, I was in the water one day and something, like, literally snatched off my arm. Oh, wait, no, I remember what snatched off my arm. A barracuda snatched it off. It looked, it looked like it was going at a speed of 100 miles an hour. And it snatched my arm right off. Nearly passed out. A group of divers had to pull me out of the water. And that's how you survived, at least. Well, if those divers weren't there, I would have been dead and I wouldn't have met Jake. Right? Yeah, right. Huh? Did you guys see that over there? See what? Hmm. Huh. I actually saw it too. Me, me and, um, Goblin here for, both saw a, um, gray fin, Batman. A gray fin. Oh, don't tell me it's a shark. It can't be a shark. It could be just something, somebody messing with us. Yeah, because sharks don't like our warm water. Well, me and Goblin are going to head back to the shore, okay? Alright, see y'all later. Swim away, swim away! Wait, what the heck is that? <gasps> Gosh, Lily is a fast swimmer. Yeah, faster than me, at least. Oh my gosh. I knew it was a shark. To be continued.